Hi guys, my name is Srikant Tidam. Hope you are doing well. So today I'm going to explain you how to backup SharePoint. So before that, we have to configure, we have to meet the pre-request. So here we have to configure the modern authentication. So in order to configure, we have to follow these five steps. Once you configure these five steps, then only you can backup Microsoft 365 data. So here you can backup Exchange Online, SharePoint and OneDrive and Teams. So before that we have to meet this requirement. So you can watch my previous videos. I already configured all these things. Okay. So how to create SharePoint Online Backup Plan. So create a SharePoint Online Backup Plan. So here login in your UDP console. Now create a plan give the name select SharePoint online select the proxy server now click on add click on add SharePoint online source select the first option Here we already downloaded the certificate. So in case if you are uploading from your server, we have to use private certificate. Browse, select private. Now give the password. Next. So you have to give the application ID which you have configured in Azure portal. To the username which you login into Azure portal. Search this option and click on connect. Configuring the required Azure roles and permissions for this application. So it will check all the permissions in case if it is missing it will try to configure it. However we already configured these permissions. Okay, so we connected successfully. So if you are selecting this option, so whatever the SharePoint sites you have, it will back up everything. Okay, but in case if you want to back up individual sites, you can uncheck this option. So currently I don't have any sites, but still I will select this. <coughs> and click on save so I added the site give the data to destination click on save So here we created SharePoint Online Backup successfully. Okay, thank you for watching guys.